During menopause, the production of the female hormones estrogen and progesterone declined dramatically, causing frequent symptoms such as hot flashes, irritability, and trouble sleeping. Like many women, Karen Landry found that hormone replacement therapy was effective in treating these symptoms, but she was concerned by the findings of a recent study that showed a slight increase in the risk of significant side effects in some women taking hormones. I've been on hormone replacement therapy for eight years, and after everything came out in the media, I was confused about contradictory reports from both areas of the studies that were done. Ms. Landry decided to learn more about the benefits and risks of hormone replacement therapy. She did some research on the subject and then went to see her OBGYN, Dr. Rose Bruyette. They talked about her concerns, her own risk factors, and the results of the recent study. The arm of the study that included estrogen and progesterone was halted because analysis of the data showed that there was actually an increased risk of cardiovascular events such as stroke and heart attack rather than a decrease, which is what was expected. Dr. Bruyette helped Ms. Landry analyze this new data and apply it to her own case. As it turns out, hormone replacement therapy is still a good option for many women. What I advise the woman is to first assess her personal risk for uh, cardiovascular events and blood clots. If she is not an increased risk, then it is perfectly safe for her to take hormone replacement therapy for uh, a short period of time, and this may be two, three years, depending on her particular needs. Hormone replacement therapy doesn't have to go on for the rest of your life. It can be for short term and still give the benefits of he helping women get through some of the symptoms of menopause. If you're taking hormone replacement therapy or considering it, take a tip from Karen Landry. Read about it, assess your own risk factors, and then talk with your doctor. From the LSU Health Sciences Center in Shreveport, I'm Dr. Keith Payne.